All right, and I'm. You want to do your intro? I want to eat my bread. That's what I want to do. Okay. Well, nom, 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 nom. hi, I'm Malachi Wickerman. Where's my phone with my little audio texted script that I texted to you? Okay, I'm Malachi Wickerman. I'm the coordinator of a project called Toronto Tales. We have a an indie writing slash self publishing project going on. We got the dot com and and a YouTube channel of the same name, Toronto Tales. And we're the, the YouTube channel make ridiculous videos with some uh, ridiculous content, and we try to teach you a little mini history lesson. At the same time, hopefully you laugh, and uh, soon we might rechristen that as History Love, HistoryLove.com. And you killed me. You, you're like such a weasel running behind me, stabbing me while I'm trying to talk to the people. So um, what else did I want to tell the people? Who are you? Don't do it, Anakin. I have the high ground. I'm from a place called Jen Corzad in the YouTube world. This is Jen. I'm Jen and from they Jen do, Corzad. We they do, do gaming. We do gaming videos at our channel on YouTube. Check it out, Jen Corzad. Um... I'm older, he's young and foolish. I'm a newbie at Minecraft. At Trona Tales, we, we're trying to, we do uh, writing, creative, blah, 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 but we're trying to get into a little bit of gaming too, trying to learn about it, and this is sort of an unscripted interview where we're gonna learn about how to move around and maneuver my little Minecraft man in Minecraft. And this guy sitting next to me is gonna teach me. What do I do, oh guru? Of the crafting of the mines. Well, before anything, we're gonna have to take a look at um, moving, because if you've never played Minecraft before, what did you ask me? Um, what do I do, Guru? First thing I gotta do is respawn, because you murdered me from behind. <laughs> well, I guess I'll just give a brief explanation of what Minecraft oh actually my is. Gosh, I'm on top of a tree. Because if you've never played it before, you're gonna you're gonna wonder. As you can see, it's a game made up entirely of blocks. I'm staring at me. The physics of Minecraft is the physics of Minecraft is basically derives right from blocks themselves. What you do is you break blocks, and then you place them in your own desired order, however you want to do it. And within this game, people have made so many things like giant castles Zero. and everything. And it's really evolved from when it first started, but. What we're going to be looking at today. I'll talk to you. I got a secret for you. What are you doing, you weirdo? We're going to be looking at how Falling to move. The tree. I don't know how to move. Okay, I'm going to pretend I don't know how to move, but about a month ago, I didn't know how to move. You should have seen me. It was funny. We'll see if we can recreate that. How do I get off of this tree? What? Um, Press F5, and then I won't be staring at myself anymore? I'll swim underwater for 10 minutes. Now my POV. Right. And we are. So in order to move, the first thing you want to do is you want to take your left hand and you're going to place it on the left side of your keyboard on the keys W, A, S, and D. And you're only going to use your first three fingers, of course. That spells, what's up? No, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. Um, imagine them as the arrow keys on the right side of your keyboard. Um, uh, yeah, because it's going to, W moves you up, S moves you back, A is left, and D is to the right. So if you do that right away, you're going to get a feel for how to a, actually strafe around like that. D. And then your right a, hand is going to go on your mouse, and it's going to move your camera as, angle as I'm showing you right now. D. Oops. Don't press E. Come here. That's what I'm showing you. I don't understand. Hey. Oh, you're invisible. That's just great. Oh, there you are. What okay. you get for teleporting me? <laughs> All right, so people if, don't understand if that. If you're concept. like this guy right here, and if you've never played before, you may run into the problem of, oh no, what do I do now? There's a hill. There's an incline, kind an of incline. Looks like stairs to me. Minecraft has I no concept you. of an incline. <laughs> it's just blocks. Think Lego. So in order to do this, you're going to use, again, your left hand. While while holding the forward button, you're also going to press the space bar Which, at the same time. The forward button? W. W. Key Hold w. down W and press the space bar with my left thumb. Whoa! Look at that. Whoa! Look at that. Added in oh, yet. man! You got the legs of Mario. Oh, man. And if I go press the D, whoa! 
You were born dancer. Oh, right? no. And I pressed the, the, the left one, A. I got to jump again. Jump again. Jump again. Oh, wow. Jump on it. Jump on it. Jump, 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 jump. Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so then you can get a feel for it. The next thing that you're going to want to look at is... Um, How do I look left and right? With your mouse. I already told you that. Oh, I... Yeah. Did you hear me? I, I'm old. I forget things. What? I don't rely on my memory. My hearing is fine. Right. I'm not that old. So just walk around a little bit and get a feel for that. Jump around. If you fall into the water, of course, in order to swim and in the water... King of the hill. All you have to do is hold the space bar and, and move with the respective keys, W, A, C, and D, uh, to move around. Make sure you hold the space bar, and otherwise you're going to fall and sink just like I'm doing right now. And this little, the on the bottom right, above my oh. my health bar, <laughs> I killed me. bubbles. And as soon as that runs this, out, I'm going to start getting hit. This is what happens when you fall. Okay, I'm respawning. Just like this. Oh, ow. I'm on top of the tree again. Eventually you will die. This is a Look, a cow. <clears throat> yes, you're right. W makes me go forward. So next we're going to take a look at the bottom. How do I milk of, the cow? At the bottom of your screen. You need a bucket. You're going to take a look <laughs> at the bottom of your screen. I could really think there was an answer to that question. <laughs> yeah, I'd rather play with the udder. <laughs> <laughs> so the bottom thing on your screen there, you can notice a few different things going on here. The, the bar in between the hearts and the um the little the squares down there that's your experience bar when you kill things or mine certain uh, certain objects you get experience or mine is empty yeah that's because you have no experience in life i do <clears throat> yeah Boy, chicken. what, what a twist see, that is see now if i if i kill this chicken here as, as you notice the green bar slowly fills up eventually it'll fill up and it'll get as soon as it fills up the, the number one will appear in the middle uh in between my health and my food Bar there, and that'll keep going up forever and ever. And later on, you can enchant with it. So that's not something you even need to really worry about right now. My God, where have you gone? You're gonna look at right now. I've been teleported. In the bottom left, there's gonna well, on the very bottom of the screen, those squares there. That's your hot bar. There you are, the man in Scroll black. Scroll with your wheel, and then you can select different objects that you're gonna play with, <laughs> like this. Your your name is Schlong. Well, <laughs> look where my Schlong just ended up. <laughs> <laughs> Hit F5. <laughs> oh man, that ain't right. From the front. That ain't right. Oh man. Why are you doing that? Uh, I guess I won't kill you. That'll be nice. Porcupine. You want a cold. <laughs> so on the bottom left, there's your Truck. hearts. That's your life. As soon as that all runs out, you, you will keep me die. Breathing. And on the bottom right is your food. So you're going to get food from either killing animals or growing plants. Becoming a farmer, and if that runs out, you will start to lo slowly lose health until you die. So you got to make sure you stay healthy, stay, stay thirsty, stay thirsty, my friends. Well, if I had actually Thanks. played this game before, which I haven't, because I'm a complete newbie, like the rest of these old people out here that want to learn how to play <laughs> Minecraft like their kids, I wouldn't know that I should come over here and start whacking at this tree, right? And uh, so I can get some wood and create some some tools. Hey guys, let's go egg that Malwicker guy. I missed. Of course. Here, have some raw meat. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna tickle you. What are you doing? I'm working here. I'm Tick trying. I'm tickling crafting. you with a feather. Now laugh. <laughs> How's that? Hey, thanks for the wood. <laughs> it's the lung cancer laugh. <laughs> it's not funny. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> Mwah, uh, uh. All right, so next we're going to look at gathering resources. I have some resources. I have an arrow, a raw chicken, a feather, and a big block Easy, of wood. One of the easiest things to break is just the grass block. It just takes a couple seconds when holding in the left click w button. W, space bar to jump. I can't jump high enough. Well, that's because there's two blocks. When you jump, you can only jump up one... The, the, oh, one? the length of one block. Oh, God, there's two. So if there's two, you have to find another way around oh, it. Man. So like I said, grass is easy to break, or dirt blocks, I should say. And as you notice, when you break it, a miniature version of it appears. And when you walk over it, you gather it into your inventory here. 
So then with the right click, because before you were holding in the left click to, to break and gather the resources, you can then place the blocks in any desired manner that you want them to be placed in. So what, what if I want to beat the dirt with my chicken instead of uh, my arrow? Well, then it's going to be a pretty... How do I select the chicken instead of the arrow? It might be a big mess then. Uh, that, that you're going to use your either the the number the numerical key, keys on the top of the keyboard one through nine will will select. Really, I didn't even know that. <laughs> Those will select the different uh, spaces in your hotbar, or hot you bar. can use the ma the mouse wheel itself. Are you sure? I'm Oops. pressing my numbers over here. No, 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 on the right side of the keyboard like that. You have to do it on the top of your keyboard. Oh, up there. Yes. The one, then two. They're kind of like oh, look at that. Three, four. So you can do everything with your hands. Yes, just you like don't really this. have to have this little wheel like I'm pretending I don't know about. It can be much faster when you need to switch items in a tight situation. By going one, you can go directly to three instead of having to use the mouse wheel to scroll over and accurately get on there. It's much more accurate and quick. On some mouse, mouses, mice, mouses, mice. Anyway, on some of those Mises. things... I hate Mises to pieces. <laughs> on some of those things, there is actually um, one, maybe one through four numerical uh, buttons on there, which act as the numerical keys on the top of your keyboard. So you can actually use that as well to get to switch. That wasn't messy. Part. I beat it with the chicken. Well, did you get chicken juice everywhere? No, that happens when you choke a chicken, though. Oh, oh, where did the G rating go? Oh no! Gone with the wind. Can I beat a Can I beat a block with my chicken? If you so desire to. Now what you're block, happening. What you're hitting there is stone. Oh man, like a I, block. I mean, oh, it did. I actually did get it. I thought it wouldn't break at all. I was mistaken. All right. So as you can <laughs> see here, do? go ahead and try to break that block. Again. I just hit you with my chicken. Break the snow if I want. So as you can see, what's happening here is it takes a very long time in order to mine this block up. That's because it's stone, and you're using your fist or chicken, whatever it is. It's the same. Um, and it's going to take a very long time in order to break this. Not efficient at all. And not to mention, you don't get anything from it when you use your hand alone. What you got there? A big block of dirt in your hand? Nifty. How about the feather? That's can probably not my gonna, feathers. It's not going to work very well, is it? No. <coughs> you Where'd you go? It. So, in order to mine this stone here, what we're going to want to do, uh -oh, we're long. running out of time here. Tershlong. Ershlong. What we're going to need to do is we're going to need to make um, a pickaxe. Once we make a pickaxe, we can then gather that stone. I know. What does that mean? What does that mean? So, you're going to want to run up to a tree like this and just beat it with your fist. Beat your fist bloody. Scroll. Beat it! Beat that wood. Only one tree. All right, we gotta hurry up, otherwise we're gonna get. Destroyed. Long video, long video. Well, I mean, we're gonna die. Oh, nighttime will fall, and it gets scary at night, doesn't it? So, All right, so. so now that you gathered some wood, yeah. you're gonna want to open up your inventory with the letter E. E. The E key. Hey, look and, at that! And up in this little crafting thing up here. Up here. That'd be the one. Oh, look at my head spin. Cool, man. Mm -hmm. I got rhythm. I got rhythm. I got the moves. Okay, this thing goes here, and then what do I do? I got the moves like <clears throat> one. I'm like Jagger, though. So you're gonna want to oh. put your wood blocks that you gathered oh, look. into your little crafting square up there. Something and over turn here. Into planks. So you click on the planks over there, mm -hmm. and you can do that as many times as you want. Which you can only stack things up to an amount of 64. After that, it doesn't stack anymore. Well, most of them. Some aren't. Right, I'm, I'm, I'm going to skip ahead and build my little crafting table here. The only problem is now I have nothing to craft with because I only want these. You want to take all four or four planks, and you're gonna to want to put them in each of the spaces in your little crafting. Crafting table appears. Oh, it's raining. Achievement. The Thanks freaks come out in the rain too, don't they? The freaks come out at night. Freaks come out. But <coughs> don't let YouTube get met. Did you hit me so again? You, so now that we've made a crafting table, you're gonna to want to throw it down back with the right click on any space that you want, as long as you're not standing in the space. Find a guy. And in here, you're going to want to make sticks using two planks, one above the other. Like this. Took all the wood. No and make wood. a pickaxe. And when you craft, you're kind, of, you're kind of shaping the object that you're crafting. So think of a pickaxe. You need a handle, which would be two sticks. Two and, sticks? Okay. And, and you get some sticks. And then 
three on the very top, like so. That'll make a wooden pickaxe. It's amazing. Like that. Sticks again is one plank above the other. It's like Oh, that's dirt. That's not. So now that we have a pickaxe, we run over here. To make it dirty. Now, dirt. as you notice, the stone is mining much quicker than it used to be. And you actually gather resources from it. By holding the shift and do that. Oh, they all go at the same time. Okay, great. Now I need sticks. So you just keep going this mine away. these directions. And you notice this stuff here? This is ore. This is coal, actually. And it's within the stone. So you can mine that with a wooden pickaxe, just like stone. But it takes a little bit longer to mine. You notice the drops coal instead oh, of cobblestone. Some stone. Yeah, that would be an axe. Now that we, we want to pick it, got some coal, you're going to want to go into your crafting again. By right clicking on this uh, crafting table, that's how you access the crafting table itself. You're going to take some sticks, throw it in there, take your coal, throw it above it, and you get to make torches. Yay! And these light up the area, and they never run out, and they never go out, even in the rain. So that means we can sing in the rain. So I made a wooden pickaxe with some wood. And there's my crafting table stuck in a tree. It's a little hard to, to discern what that is. So as you see, if, if you can't reach into the sky anymore, if you're trying to mine a tree, if you place down a dirt block, just like this, jump onto it, suddenly you can reach. It's amazing. And as soon as you destroy all the wood on a tree, the leaves will start to disappear on their own. It's a shovel. Oh, there's a skeleton down there. It's a shovel. What's he doing? Taking, taking a whiz down there? Do skeletons whiz? Yes, he does. <clears throat> what do they use to whiz? Well, they're bone! <laughs> Um, so, and not just the pickaxe, but you can make just about anything you can think of to some other. So let's make a handle again. Whoa, what are we got going here, man? And we'll torches, corner, torches, just like this. Or you can throw them over like this, and that will give you a pickaxe or a, a hatchet, an axe, wooden axe. And axes, if you didn't guess already. They oh, mine oh, oh! I'm faster. dead. Uh -oh. We have a skeleton here. I gotta kill this guy before he dies. I got killed. I didn't even see him coming. If mob, if an enemy comes up to you, skeleton, zombie, spider, stay away from creepers. Um, you just gotta fight back. Spawn me to you, you oh guru. Careful. Spawn me to you, oh guru. So anyway, I I'm not really controlling my end of things here. I'm. I'm probably going to write a blog entry about this on tronatales.com and explain the fact that I don't know nothing about no gaming, man, and, uh, and I'll explain interview stuff, no script, and uh, all that. And I might invite some friends from uh, the, the History Love Project to make some comments on this, this video before it's uh, completely edited. There, I just hey, made a sword. The schlong earned an achievement. Yay. Time to strike. Oh, he must be a miner, and when miners mm -hmm. strike, all oh, heck breaks loose. I said heck. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> That's cool. What was that? I think a skeleton just shot you. Yeah, skeletons have bows and arrows. Oh, man. I have a tail. Oh, I Look, have a... The skeleton keeps shooting you. What's going on? <laughs> I think one more hit and you might be dead. You better run and hide before he can get to you. Like, totally suck. Just gonna quit. Don't be a poor sport. <laughs> you don't want me to kill you, dude, because I will kill you. I'm warning you. You hit me all my time. Yeah, you say that after I decide to make my escape. <laughs> I'm just gonna walk on water. I'm still gonna hit you. What is that? Oh no. Java update. Nobody likes it. Don't gonna, you know we're recording here, Java? You're gonna drown. Stinking Java. I love Java. I'm gonna learn to program in Java again. I'm a C guy.
Where is the rest of me? I've done some Java. I do Java, man. Keeps me awake at night. Once upon a time, I wrote some code. And eventually, I'm going to learn to write some mods, and we're going to do a bigger pro... Oh, you suck. Suck. Direct hit. Oh, yeah. Such a spineless girl. jellyfish. You know, I'm so happy. Sneak attack. Me and my chair are going to have oh. sexy time. Me and three. Sexy time. Shake it, I knew you would do this to me. Oh yeah. I'm a newbie. I don't know that I can press the letter T and type in. Look at my haircut. It is beautiful. You see that? No, I mean forward slash and Look at those graphs. game mode one. And now you can't hear me no more because when I press the letter E, I got it all. Stop hacking my game over there. I'm trying to show the people something. What? Oh. We're not that far yet. Oh. Now I got a zombie up my arrow hole. <laughs> That's nice. I don't have arrow holes. Oh, you do. This is it's all stuffed with arrows. Probably, <laughs> I hope you die, weirdo. So yes, we covered moving, a little bit of crafting. Hacking. You food. You always need lots of food. Backstabbing. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at that. Cow tipper. Cow tipping. Wow. Alright. So we kind of skipped a couple things. Like, one of the most important things in Minecraft is before the first night, you always want to build a shelter. What are you trying to do there? I've been... What? I have permission. You're this is my server. <laughs> You don't have permission. You opt me out of my own server, you rat hackers, <laughs> backstabber. No, Jen's a good guy. Now you're going to have to ask me love. very nicely. It's all love, man. All brother. Dog. Yeah. It's all. You're going to have to ask me very nicely if you, you want something. <clears throat> and you have to kiss my toe. You don't have a toe. And then I might think about it. Might... Actually, I have one big you, toe. You have a Lego. <laughs> <laughs> it's a toeless Lego. Yeah. Thank you. Alright, so I'm going to build a shelter real quick. It's not going to be an amazing shelter, but you know, you need a shelter in Minecraft, especially in the first one. In the, even though the first one is. This old. video is getting really long. Yes, and for my POV, all I'm doing is walking on water. Me llama Jesus! No. No? ¿Estás seguro? Bueno. He's sexy. Muy guapo. Guapo. Two? Two. Dos. <laughs> Tú estás feo. Like, so let's nice talk about your mama like that. No diga me de esta que mi mamacita. Yeah, I don't Cabrón. speak Espanoles. So there's going to be a problem there. No hay uno problema, cabrón. At least no I have a house problem. and you don't. Can you build a house already? Maybe. I see a little dirt ring over there. <laughs> That's that's my house, huh? Thanks. No, that here's was, all my crap before I got killed. That's also my. House. I got my crap back. Why are you doing that? I know you're behind me. What? So, no, you're not. I'm not behind you. I don't like you, you behind me. I don't like you behind me. Well, it's not your choice, man. Is it? I'll be behind you if I want to be behind you. You're so gay. But that's not a bad thing. We're politically correct here, but uh, where are we? Toronto Tales? Uh, we're, <coughs> in, we're in Jen Corzad land. Are you sure? Yes, it's a fun amusement park. Come enjoy the rides. How, how, how do we segue out of this video? Like this. Alright, thanks if, for watching, guys. If I'm bored, they're bored. I gotta thanks build my stone pickaxe series, first. This the beginning of this series. Please leave a like if you enjoyed. And subscribe to keep up to date and for more.
If you like my house, give it a like. If you like my name Schlong, leave a like. Basically what I'm saying is like this video. Are you asking the people if they like Schlong? I like Schlong. Hashtag Schlong. Wow. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, all that good stuff. Malachi Wickerman. I write stuff. I make up stories. I dig deep holes. Master me. Master she. Whack, 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 whack. Oh, I can't kill you. You suck. Why can't you kill me? I don't know. Cause Ouch. You're... Oh, I can. Do you want me to kill you? Well, that just looks weird. <laughs> Goodbye. We're done, right? I guess so. Yeah. <clears throat> Where's our outro? Right here. Bing. I see it.